week I realized I learned that Christian deep down has a little Spanish heritage inside him, okay? And he likes to move to that music. Mexican. My apologies. And I absolutely loved everything about that music. It was beautiful. But this week, there were so many different communities and pages and like individual brands of tailgating. We are working with three. The main one is gonna be the boys at Los Reyes. They host the big, great one. It's all in the line at Thunder Out. Then we got a guy named a Bolt School and then we have Swoopin' D, all right? His name's Mike. What? These are the individual characters that host their own tailgate. But they're all beauties. That's where we technically were last week, but apparently this one's bigger and better. Apparently the Chargers fans like to get a little more after it. Oh, oh! So I think we are in for definitely another fun tailgate in Los Angeles. Now we're just fueling up. All right, we got Malte in the back. Mezaps, do you want to introduce Malte to the channel? Yeah, this is my boy uh, Malte. He's from Germany. He lived with me for about a year and he lives in LA. So bringing him out to the Chargers tailgate. What's up, y'all? I'll be here for this game. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. That might be the most chill dude in America right yeah. there. What are we going to do today? We're getting lit. Yeah. 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 I haven't been this fired up in a minute. If I see another stadium filled of red and you're not from San Francisco, I what the hell's going on in Los Angeles? Angeles. Yeah, I haven't seen the Chargers fan yet. What the? There's a Lamar Jackson fan. I have seen more Lamar Jackson jerseys than Justin Herbie jerseys. What the good hell, man? There's a fan. Look at that, look at that oh nasty Herbie jersey. Uh, more look, more Chiefs fans coming in. More Chiefs fans. Wise words, but I can't remember who, but sometimes in life, you either crank that soldier boy, it's gonna crank you, and today, I'm getting cranked by that soldier boy. So, you know, it's one of those days. So, uh, go Chargers. Oh, go Chiefs! Oh. <laughs> Friendly banter, you gotta love that. This is a big ass shop, man. Hey, big ass shop for a big ass country, all right? Hey, cheers, cheers to Malte, to the... cheers to Germany. I absolutely love this guy. This guy's the most chill dude on the planet. Bolt Nation, let's fucking ride. Hey. Best drink ever. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yes, sir. Whoa. <coughs> the thing is, kind of gives you that like, wake up in the morning snuff in the face. Yeah. <laughs> but then after, <laughs> vanilla after. Like vanilla yeah, after yeah. the end. The cream. Yeah. yeah. You like cream. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> you guys from Can uh, from, from Calgary? Missouri? Calgary. Okay. Alberta? Oh, yeah. no, we're from Toronto. All right. Let's go, baby. Look at this. Good old Canadian. You guys are Chiefs fans? Yeah, we're Chiefs fans. What's the logistics behind that one? My dad was a Chiefs fan. Okay. Me and my brother are little. And okay. So right after they won their two Super Bowls? <laughs> no, That's way cool. before. Way okay. back in the day. How does it feel that we're going to hand the first L today? Oh. I, hope, I hope it's a good game. Oh. Yeah, me too. At the end of the day, we want we want both teams to. Nice fans, man. I just want you to cheer me back. <laughs> Gentlemen, we're going to Thunder Alley right now, all right? I need energy. I've heard good things about Thunder Alley. Some good vibes right now. Chip is on a fucking all-time high right now. I love that shit. Because that means I don't have to do as much. We're seeing a sea of red again. And when the Chargers, who are a plus seven and a half underdog today, come out and give the Chiefs their first fucking loss and the boys go 4-0, I want someone in the comments to comment, yo, Chianchi, I want to suck your cock. Or just subscribe. Yeah, I think that's better. <laughs> Let's have a fucking day, fellas. I've seen too many Chiefs fans. It's pissing me off. I know it's pissing you off, too. I know it damn well. All right, those guys were chill. No Chargers. <laughs> yeah, we get it. You won two Super Bowls. You don't have to say anything. <laughs> Fuck. I hate that about Chiefs fans because they know they're so sick. They don't even say anything. Dude. I feel like I'm a fucking Middle Tennessee showing up at Bama today. Yo, honestly, that's a great way to describe it. I feel like kind of a piece of shit. How are you? Good to meet you. Good Ladies and gentlemen, the person to my left, you're right, this is Mike from Bold School. Mike, talk to the people. Give me your ideal tailgating scene. Like, what do you guys do different here? The food, music. You gotta have music. You gotta have a lot of alcohol. That's a sauce right there. I think we need to tap into some beverages. Beverages? Whoa, they're bringing out the haymakers. You know what that is? I actually do Mexican. not know what this is. That's some real Mexican shit right there, dog. Oh, boy, this is straight from Mexico? Straight from Mexico, straight across the border, my boy. Good Jesus, man. All right, you know what? Today, we're going to let the Mexicans teach me a little something. I want to be dancing a little bit. I want to have a good time. Right? You're in LA, bro. This is Mexico. What's your name? Oh, you want me to just play yeah. it? OK. That's yeah. Yeah. Cheers to Bolt School. I fucking love these guys. Hey. Yeah. I want them to say, fuck the Chiefs. Go Bolt, baby. Horchata, okay, horchata. Oh I'm feeling one right now, this is beautiful. That one's even better. You guys are just getting us fucked up. No, no, look at that cream on the That's fucking some imported shit right there. They're talking how good the tamarind is. I'm like, dude, I love it. They're like, dude, take another one. Okay. Let's make it happen, let's go. Justin Herbert, plus 230 passing yards, two touchdowns. How's your mother? Jim Harbaugh! 
at 10 o'clock? Yeah, yeah, 10 o'clock. This is breakfast for us. 10.30 breakfast. I love this place.
wildest thing you've ever seen at a Thunder Alley tailgate. I saw somebody try to jump through a table and then missed and break their tailbone. Broke their, like their ass bone? Their whole ass bone. I've seen a Raiders fan get their head cracked open over there after the game was over. So it was Raider or Raider violence. The guy fell and the guy just... He curb stomped it. Curb stomped. That guy probably is dead now, but who knows? Thank you. Just naked women. Yes. Why are they walking around like tits out and shit? Definitely. Two girls dancing, bro, getting wild, just grinding on each other. Almost got in the mix. Did you get in the mix? No, bro. I got almost. I'd love to. Oh, but you got a wife. Got a wife, bro. But that I mean the bitches. The bitches? Yeah. I agree with them on the bitches, bro. Yeah. 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 What do you think about that statement? I fucking love yeah. this. Yes, sir. Thank you. Put up with that shit. Let's go. What is the biggest red flag in a football fan? Being a Raiders fan, you have priors, you don't have good judgment, most likely a criminal, and just get it like simple. Raider fans are ugly. They're ugly, ugly, toxic. They have nothing good going for them if you willingly choose to be a Raiders fan. Come on. I don't like none of the other teams to come in to Thunder Alley. We throw the best party ever, bro. Thunder Alley is the best party. Hell yeah. Hell fucking yeah. That would be being a Chiefs fan or a Raiders fan. Chiefs fan. Bandwagon. 75% of the fans here today are transplant fans. Probably became fans after the first Super Bowl. Probably couldn't name at least 10 players. Biggest ref that is a football fan is when they start following the team just because they win the Super Bowl that year. You want to give me some examples? This girl Whoa. actually used to wear red and gold for a different team. It was the Rams yeah. and Chiefs game right before the Super Bowl that got me a Chiefs fan. I'm going to tell you the truth. When you've been a Niner fan like me since the 80s, you've seen the ups and the downs. Yeah. You got to roll with it, baby. So when you put on that red and gold, you should have never switched sides. Bro, are you like kind of hurt by that and shit or not? A little bit. A little bit. Because you know why? Because I'm a real Niner fan. Oh, that's my German army. It's my damn. Oh, they're German? Uh, yeah. 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 But ready? Oh my god, you see that? I went five yards backwards, he didn't even move. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. What's wrong with you? You had a brand of what? No, I'm Italian. It's almost like it's two bros just wrestling. Well, go again. It's just by the way, seventh time. Three, two, one. Ah, you didn't fucking move me, bro. Oh my god. These guys, Chargers Nation, bolt up. Who's got it better than us? Us! Now you guys. Fun. Yeah, you know what I mean? Get in. 
Divisional game, home game for the Chargers. These are always close. For that reason, Chargers to cover plus seven. Chargers money line for the vibes. The over was 41. Every game, Patrick Mahomes, Justin Herbert has been an over all seven games. Over is a lock. My guy Justin Herbert's on purpose sets. Chargers, fuck it in, I threw it on the money line. I don't even want the points. We're going four and oh. We don't show up to SoFi without a W. We don't show up to an NFL game no. without a W. No. Over 41 and a half. I threw under three and a half field goals. You know why? Because these teams are going for touchdown today. Divisional matchup, we don't hit field goals. Those are my three bets of the day. Lock it in. Can I be honest? I did over three and a half field goals. Divisional game. The game gets a little bit tight. For that reason, I went over on the field goals. I respect his decision. May the best man win. Go Chargers, hold up, pit show. I love this shit. The Chargers have a great plan this week, Jim. No, 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 no. He's launching it down to Kelsey. That'll quiet a few folks. Big games in this building it's just tied Gonzalez with the all-time record most receptions in Kansas City history. That ball was actually fumbled by Steele. The rookie puffs it up, and the Chargers have recovered. That's his second lost game for Steele in the last three weeks. Let's see where you're at. First and ten. There goes Dobbins. Dobbins. As a pickup for 12. Come on! Well, I'm going for blood today. The Chiefs have been like fugazi, a little lucky. Stripped it, Molden recovered it. Here is a screen pass set up for Disley. And he's got running room to tight end. Down inside the 30 to the 25 yard line. The boy! From the pocket. Hakanke spins around Tranquil. He's got it inside the 10 yard line. I'm high-fiving everybody. Pistol, look at the front. Get a little bit of everything. They keep stealing the game at running back as Patrick goes down and gets intercepted. Got picked off by Fulton. Fulton going through traffic and he lost the ball. He lost the ball. It's near the sideline. Let's see what they do. Gonna stay with the Chargers. We got it back. We got it back. We got it back. What is going on? Thank you for everything right there, bro. He's done. His legs broken. That's part of the reason Kelsey was off to a finish start. Third and 25. Bouncing outside is Dobbins. He was going to get stuck for no gain and fought for about four. Hear me out. It's a really deep field goal. Trying to get points off the interception and three more added to the total. Yeah! Let's go! Let's go! 10 nothing. Los Angeles. They rush by. They collapse on the quarterback and drop him for the set. Spot to three. Same thing again. Yes. I fucking love the NFL game. I love the National Football League. You don't understand. I have two hundred dollars on first half spread and a hundred dollars on Chargers money line at half. I win three eighty at half. Oh my god. We need just save football, and we win a lot of money at half. That's rare air, and he's already established that to Kelsey. Oh. We need a Third and nine. Here they come. And Mahomes cannot get away. Exactly what we needed. But this one, this one is going deep for Worthy. And the rookie holds it in. That's the longest touchdown pass for Mahomes in a long time. Why do we get out of our seats? Bad things happen. 10 7 now. We still have the lead. Bro, we left and it's been all teams the entire time. So I think we just stick to our methods here in Dallas. As long as we watch the game, we win the game. Mahomes rifles it. 
Got his man. It's uh, if they get a field goal, I will be punching so much air. Go make this. Oh my god. I have $380 on the line. Chance to tie it. 65 yards for a career long Butker's kick. Short. No good. I just made $380 profit. I'm the happiest camper right now. Has the first down as he turns it on. Cook has the angle, and the Chargers have a big game with that one. I mean, this is what 59? What is this? Oh, that nice was distance. Way that is distance. No good. That's a design for him. Third and 11. Pass to Watson. On the ground. First down. Off to the good guys. Hulch. Pressure. Going to be sacked. Khalil Mack Stop. out there. Stop. They're going for a 10-10 game here. I have over three and a half field goals. This would be two. Which doesn't look great, but promising. Butker's kick. It's good, right down the middle. This has been a sneaky, weird game. Not a lot of scoring, weird offense. Blitz, flags, Palmer, the catch for the first down. There's a flag. Just give it to me. Just give it to me. I love you. The official. It's not rigged. I think we're in. You go rigged. It's touchdown range. Another blitz. Pass. Caught. There's that first catch. Yes, yes. First down. All right, what do you do here? You go for it. Honestly, he's right. You got to do this shit if you want to win. They're going for it. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. You're almost getting to the first down. Here's a fourth down play. Jones coming after him. Flag is down, and the pass is incomplete. I only worry, and I think you know what the worry is. That was an exact spot. He's been a charger pillar here for the last. Might get the goal line carry. Let's see. First and goal. He does. He won. Big stop. Fighting for it. Gets it. Touchdown. Kansas City. It's a one-score game. I need Justin Herbert. Double down on the Percocets. Lock in. Aaron Rodgers in 2011. Get a goddamn touchdown to bring this game to OT. And then win it. Someone's going to have to dial in. Toss him a Percocet, Doc, and let the kid play. He's a screen. The Dobbins. Nice cut. Got a first down. And Dobbins into the pile at the 46. First down, first down, first down. One first down at a time. We need magic. Need some Chargers magic. Nine times in this game. Looks like even more. Attempt for coming up. As he gets sacked back at the 41. Chris Jones. This is awesome. Believe, believe. We need this. Looks left, goes middle. Goes to Worthy, and the rookie has the first down. On their way, 30 seconds to just run off. Gentlemen, the undefeated record ends right now here in SoFi Stadium. We're three and one on the channel. Chiefs take this one, unfortunately. Not proud. Today was not a good day for the referees and the Los Angeles Chargers. Being said, we'll see you guys next week. Like, comment, subscribe. Hey, Steelers, baby. I hate the Kansas City Chiefs.